going, everyone? Maryland here, and I'm getting attacked by a giant flying fox. Oh, man. Yeah, so, I don't know. I was thinking about it, and, uh, oh, man, look at this raven. Uh, yeah, I was thinking about it, and I know I was going to hold off on checking out the temple for a while, the jungle temple, but you know what? I was thinking about it some more, and I realized I want to get the pick axe or the pick pick saw that's the thing the pick saw disney pick saw no 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 not not the disney one um but yeah i want to get that so i can mine up some of that brick so uh, one of my projects that i've kind of quote kind of been working on you know what i should probably just buff and be done with it um one of the projects that i want to work on while it's halloween or at least the halloween season i want to work on a uh Oh man, you know what? <laughs> this is not working as well as I would like it to. Um, I, I wanna work on a farm for getting um, like pirate maps and goodie bags and stuff. I'm gonna need a whole bunch of them, so I figure I might as well set something up around the ocean. And a jungle farm, let's face it, that's probably among the best things you can make. I'm gonna go ahead and swap out some of my stuff. Let's see. Let's get rid of the sorcerer emblem for right now. All right, I'm a werewolf. Uh, fish. Maybe I should fish here. I don't know. Um, oh, jeez, that thing. Yeah, let's just switch to my uber healing armor. I love it. It's just so powerful. Um, but yeah, I need to mine up some of that jungle temple brick stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of that because I want to make an artificial jungle. Oh, hey, goodie bag, cool. Uh, I wanna make an artificial jungle over by one of the oceans. And I was thinking, well, first I was thinking maybe I should make it a crimson ocean farm thing. But then the more I thought about it, it's like, no, honestly, I'll get the best bang for my buck long term if I just go ahead and make it a jungle one, so I can have a whole bunch of the uh, arapaimas or whatever, whatever that big fish thing is. Um, I need to have a lot of those going. Um, so, let me clear this out. So you might be wondering why I'm in the jungle, and actually, the reason is partially to check out the temple, or the temple, <laughs> the temple. But I also do want to, uh, I want to go to... Man, could everything just, like, chill for a moment? Um, I also wouldn't mind fighting Plantera again over here. But, you know what? It's getting kind of nasty. I don't know. Maybe I'll just hold off on that. I wanted to wait before fighting Plantera again until after I got my, um, Spectre armor. Because I'll definitely stand a better chance. And I know that there's a Plantera bulb, like, right down below. But I don't really want to use that one. There's another one I'd rather use. I'd rather actually go over here, pick up the free life fruit for some moolah. Um, but yeah, I'd like to dig over here and try to get one that way. What? Oh, I thought there was something over there. Um, oh, a ghost. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so ghosts are an underground enemy. Um hard mode only, but I do need to kill 50 of them. Where the heck is that thing? Okay, there we go. Got rid of it. Oh, man. I might also have to uh, purify some of this stuff. I don't know. I have quite a lot I need to do. What the heck? Oh, man. Yeah, the stupid crimson's getting all over the place. Ah! Oh, well, you know what? With uh, this specter armor, I guess it doesn't really even matter if I getting hit by those floaty grosses or not. Anyway, this isn't really the most exciting thing. Um, I want to dig over this way. Where is this thing? Let's make short work of those floaty grosses. Oh, jeez. Um, I want to actually head over this way just so I have a nice, relatively clear passage to get to my main arena. Um... So then I can fight Plantera there, although I don't know, I'm not doing very good. It's been a few days since I've played, so I'm a little rusty, but it should be okay. I think I'll be fine. Oh, cool. There's a moth. That's a nice rare enemy. 
Uh, definitely want to kill it. It's not that tough to kill or anything, but... Oh, come on, heal faster! Ah. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, this is bad. <laughs> jeez! Okay, this is bad. Those stupid bees are shooting so fast. And, like, from an insane distance. Okay. Alright, you know what? Let me go ahead and summon up my twins. <laughs> okay, so I'm starting to have a little bit of doubt that this will work. I might just go and fight Plantera um, using the bulb I've already seen. Uh, what is down there? Oh, well, whatever. Um, more feral claws. That's a good thing. Okay, let me grab those, and, uh, oh, there's a Crimson Mimic nearby. That's swell. Uh, let me use this. Oh, darn it. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, well. Uh, there we go. Okay, let me put away some of this stuff for later. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just gonna actually go and fight against Plantera using the one right by, uh, right by the arena. I mean, I could wait, and that'd probably be fine, but you know what? <laughs> Let's just do it. It's probably just wasting time. I just also wanted a quicker passage over to the, uh... Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Let me buff. <laughs> ah! Um... I did want quicker passage over to the jungle temple, because I don't really have an easy way to get over there right now. Um... So I figured having an easy way would be a good thing. Or, I mean, at least that was the thought, but it does not seem to be working out all that great. Oh, my poor jungle. It's so corrupt. So crimson or whatever. Oh, it's sad. Um, I don't really have much time to even look around, but I do want to just consult my map really fast. Just to see where I even am. Uh, okay, yeah, so I still have a ways to go. This doesn't really seem like all that great of an idea anymore, and now it's daytime, so I should probably swap that out. Okay, there we go. Um, man. Alright, well, so much for that idea. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna fight against Plantera over here then. Um, should be okay. Uh... I should probably just cancel all my buffs and rebuff, in all honesty. Let's see... I guess I'll leave mana regeneration. Alright, so... Let's get rid of... All of these. And the reason I'm doing that, it seems wasteful, but that way I can just buff everything at once. And I don't have to worry about running out of any of those buffs. So that's handy. Um, I also do not have my magic crystal buff thing over here, so that's a shame. Where the heck is that bulb? Oh, it's like right down there. That's no problem at all. Okay, now I don't exactly know what I'm going to do for this. I guess I'll try to do a similar thing, but I don't know. This magnet sphere might actually help too. And actually, I think the inferno fork could be helpful as well. So yeah, um, anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna find out. Oh, it's a guy. What's up, buddy? Um, what you got? Nothing that I need. Darn it. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. You're about to get wrecked by Plantera, though. Okay, let's go ahead and buff and break it. Okay, so... Try to set some stuff up here. Oh, darn it. You know what? I don't have my... Oh, I don't even have the shield of Cthulhu on me, darn it. Oh, well, we can do it without. Okay, so what I really want to watch is how much damage per second I'm doing. Oh, that's good. About a thousand. I don't really know if this is going to work for the long haul, but we're going to find out. Oh, I just let myself get hit by that. Okay, how does it work against all these tendrils? Seems like it's going all right so far. Oh, 
Oh, no, no, I don't want to use the harp. <laughs> Let's not use it. Oh, yeah, this is just going so much better, I feel. Ah! Alright, stay back, Plantera. All right, cool. Defeated Plantera again. That's very nice. Uh, yeah. Okay, so let me go ahead and try to think if I want to open this up right now or wait. I'm going to wait, actually. Well, no, there could be something really good in here. Okay, let's go ahead and open it. Uh, oh, a Pygmy Staff and a Venus Magnum. That's a good gun. All right, um... Well, that's, that's definitely good. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this will summon little pygmy guys. Cool. And I need that in order to get a certain, uh, certain armor set, a tiki armor set. Okay, well, that's fine. Let's go ahead and put all this other stuff away for right now. Oh, I do need a temple key. Um, I don't need this moon shell right now. Hey. Oh, wait. Wow, that guy's doing pretty good, actually. Okay, um, so I should probably also stack my money in there. Herp, but herp. Uh, yeah, that's that's fine. Go away from me, bat. Okay, so Plantera has been defeated once again. Um, didn't even have my thing, but that's fine. All right, so now I'm just gonna make my way over the temple, and I will see you in just a moment. There are so many enemies around. Stop. Go away. Okay, um, so, yeah, I'm over kind of by where the temple is, although I don't know if this is where the door is, so, yeah, I might have to figure that out, but, yeah, um, I should probably switch to the Spectre Hood for right now, because it definitely seems like I'm getting damaged a lot while I'm over here, <laughs> uh, which is fine, I mean, that oh, yay, Turtle Shell, that's awesome, I'm going to need so many of those. Um, all right, let's see. I see another life fruit right there. There's a plant terrible, but I think that's the one I was looking at that I thought would have been pretty good. Oh, the stupid bat. Could you stop that, please? Yeah, the downside to this, uh, this armor is it really does require you to use up a lot of potions. Um, and do a lot of damage because it just doesn't work. It has so much less defense if you aren't constantly healing. So I don't know, in a way, I almost like the other one better. But I like them both. All right, so, oh, okay, a nature's gift, uh, thanks. Nature, I appreciate your gift, kinda, not really. Um, let's see if I can get it from over here. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need to go to the other side of this, so. Yeah, I'll see you in a moment. Okay, I was just attacked by a few ghosts. <laughs> Those things are so spooky. They go through walls and everything. Um, all right, so this is not a very convenient path over there. That's for sure. But it's okay. Um, at least it looks like it'll be a very big temple, which is nice. Definitely better than just a tiny little one. Should mean plenty of traps in there. Oh, sorry, it's probably pretty dark, huh? <laughs> but yeah, there should be plenty of traps and stuff in there, which will be nice. And um, yeah, it's just kind of gonna be a pain to get to. Jeez. Whoa. All right, so uh, while exploring over here, first of all, this giant tortoise tried to attack me and kill me, but I also did find a water chest that has a breathing reed. Oh joy, really needed more of those. Okay, looks like I finally found the entrance to this thing and man, the entrance to it wasn't even uh, accessible anywhere. Like I had to dig in for it. And I don't know, it seems like all of the, uh, all of the lizard temples that I've found, it hasn't been that way, so. I don't know, it's kind of new for me. Usually I'm used to it being exposed from the surface, which is a lot more convenient than this. Uh, I don't really need that. That's not that expensive. Okay, let's go ahead. Uh, let me drop off some of this stuff. 
Okay, so I'm all set. Let's go ahead and buff again. And let's, uh, you know what? I'm gonna use the Spectre Mask here. Ow! Oh man, okay, that was not very smart. What am I doing wrong? I'm not using anything to detect traps. Wow, this is gonna come back to get me, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it probably is. Oh well, you know what? That's just how it is. Um, so let me get my key. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to come back here later. I just have to be extra cautious. In fact, maybe I can drill this up and just kind of do the whole hold it thing and just use that to scout stuff. Okay, uh, actually, let me swap the harp out for that. I don't really think I'm gonna be using the harp. Oh, yeah, I should probably actually get the key. <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, it is open. I don't need the key for anything anymore. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> oh man, I'll just have to proceed with extreme caution for the moment. Um, just keep an eye out for these buttons. All right, should be fine as long as I get those buttons. Uh, all right, let's light it up a little bit. Okay, power cell, that's good, and a uh, furnace. Spelunker potion could be handy. Um, I'm gonna leave a lot of this stuff for later. Just because right now I kind of have a goal in mind. I just want to get to the bottom of this, so to speak. All right, go away, Lizard. Uh, yeah, I definitely should have brought a potion that made it a little lighter. That would have been pretty helpful. All right, let's send this thing. Whoa, there's so many of them down there. <laughs> and they make such a funny noise. Ow. I don't think they're actually too dangerous, thankfully. All right, let's just fly down very, very slowly. All right, so there's a button over there. Let me deal with that. All right, go away. All right, let's go ahead and... I guess I don't need all of this, do I? Oh, perfect, the Danger Sense Potion, <laughs> thank you! That's actually just the thing I needed. Um, I definitely wanna get these traps. I just don't think I can even mine them until I have the next, uh, next thing I need. What is it? The, uh, Pixar, I do believe it is. Okay. Oh, you know what? This isn't going to show me the wiring now, is it? I don't think it is. Hmm. All right, well, that's okay. Should be fine. Let me just actually drop some of this stuff off. Uh, yeah, let's just do a little bit of that. Well, even if I can just kind of see where the traps are. Or no, it does show the buttons. Okay, my bad. Guess there just weren't any nearby. Uh, there we go. I love the noise lizard make. They are one of my favorite enemies just because they sound like lizard cat things. It's just really great. Uh, okay, can I see these? <gasps> no! Couldn't, I couldn't. There's too much death down there. Uh, I'm just gonna have to wait. Oh, I can mine these. Oh, that's nice. I thought I needed the, uh, the pick saw for that as well, but I guess, uh, I guess I can mine them even with my inferior thing. Man, there's a lot of traps here. Okay, well that's fine. They will soon be mine, but for right now, I'm just gonna leave them as they are. Uh, let's go ahead and drop that. Yeah, I'll come back here for like traps and stuff later. I just, I really want to fight the golem. And I'd really like to get the pick saw so I can mine some of this stuff. I think that'd be really great. Oh man, see? All this damage from the thing, from the sur or not surface, the environment. It's kind of clouding my danger sense potion. Oh well, it's okay. Oh wow, I just, <laughs> that bomb. I don't even know why I wanted that bomb. I just, I wanted to get rid of it, I guess. All right, let me get rid of that. You know, this will actually be an amazing place to farm for stuff. Like, seriously. Um, just think. I can get a lot of spawns here. 
I can get a lot of the solar fragment things. Uh, these things are the power cells, which is good. Ah, uh, this is just what I wanted as well. Wonderful. Um, yeah, so I mean, that's definitely very good. I'll have to come back here then. Yeah, maybe I should just... Oh, man. <laughs> I walked right into it. Oh, right into it. Okay, it's fine. It's not the end of the world. I fought against stronger stuff. All right. Yeah, get roasted, lizards! Oh, I pressed the button. <laughs> but I got rid of the trap! Thank goodness for that! Uh, okay, so I got plenty of power cells, which is nice. Ow, you jerk. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have a lot. Uh, that is really good. Okay, I you know what maybe I should drop my safe really quick. I am getting kind of kind of cramped on inventory Let's just go ahead and put some of this stuff away um, I guess I don't need this anymore. Oh man. Look at all those lizards But it's the bat that poses the biggest threat go figure All right, are you gonna play nicely or what yell it's well, that's nice. Uh, okay, let's not leave my safe here. Okay, let's drop off some things that I don't need right this moment, but you know. Uh, actually, all these traps and the solar things would be pretty good. Uh, you know what, let's just put some of this away. Where's my piggy bank? Where's some more junk that I don't really need anytime soon? Sure, yeah, let's just put all this stuff in. Oh, go away. Oh, no, I have the wrong weapon. Uh, wrong weapon. Okay, it's it's fine. It worked itself out. That's good. All right, but yeah, anyway. Oh, you know what? Let me hold on to this moon shell. I might actually end up using that. Um. Yeah, this will this will work. Okay, let me break that. Quick stack my money. And, oh, there's a ghost. It's so spooky. All right, all right, all right. Where is my my fire staff thing? Oh yeah, it's so good. Um, did it just like tumble at me? That was kind of weird. All right, break that. Oh man, I love going through this place. It always makes me feel like Indiana Jones or someone, you know, just kind of going through a temple, having a good old time, fighting some enemies and stuff. I guess he did a little bit of that, right? Oh man, I got so many power cells. This is very nice. Oh, I don't need any more torches now, do I? Ah, ghost. Um, <laughs> I love the sound they make. It's just so funny. Okay, let's, oh, that's a mimic. What are you doing here? Get out of here. Yeah, there we go. Um, I guess I need to break these spikes. Okay, uh, do, oh, whoa, 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 I don't know, oh, yeah, I must have broke the trap. Oh, I thought that guy was actually out to get me, <laughs> like a little, little hitman or something. Oh, man, okay, there are a lot of spiky ball traps or whatever those are. Um, that is pretty crazy. But this is the room, that's for sure. Uh, it's not quite as big as I thought it'd be. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's... I don't know, it, it should still be sufficient. Okay, let me get some of these spiky ball traps. I really gotta play it carefully, cause there's, oh, it's really tall. Oh, these lizards. Okay, let me be extremely careful here, and actually, let me make a whole bunch of wooden platforms. Okay, first of all, let me put one there. Let's hammer it. A uh, few more times. Okay, where is that banner that I just got? Yeah, let's set that up right there. Um... Oh, that's a statue. I don't need that. I just want to get rid of all these pressure plate buttons. Oh, ghost! 
of these ghosts. They're so spooky. Oh, I pressed something. Oh, no, 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 no. Didn't even see that one. Herp, but herp. All right, all right. Let me tear these ones up on the ceiling because I know that they're going to come back to get me. And that's not going to do anyone any good now, is it? Ah, uh, there is a mimic nearby. Oh, yeah, more stuff. Man, I have to say, there's a lot of loot in here. Which is always good to see. Okay, break that. Whew, so I think that's all of the uh, traps, or the pressure plates at least. So that's kind of good. So that just means I have to fight against the golem like a whole bunch of times. And this is not a very wide arena, that's for sure. But it should still be fine. I don't really think it'll be a problem. I guess I just have to wait for my health to regen. Well, that's fine. Let's eat some pie. Speed it up a little bit. And I will see you in just a moment. Okay, I don't know if this is going to work or not. We're going to find out. But let's buff and resummon my clouds because I was a derp and did that anyway. Uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so... I think that the area of effect damage from this will work pretty well. I'm not entirely sure, but typically with Golem, you want to have things kind of going as much as possible. Uh, so does Ikor work on it? Seems so. Although, I don't know, that is kind of tempting. Well, so far, no problem. If I would hit a little bit better with my, uh, <laughs> my, my fork thing, that'd be good. There we go. All right, now he's separated. Oh, okay. Let me go ahead and resummon the clouds. Honestly, just keeping the clouds over it might not be a bad strategy. Oh, wrong thing. All right, just a little bit more to go. Won't be the cleanest victory in the world, but a victory is a victory, so that is fine by me. All right, the golem has been defeated. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> uh, and holy smokes, that's a lot of stuff. Nice, it's a developer set. In fact, it's Urizor's. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so let me go ahead and equip this. What is this? Oh, flight and slow fall. Wow. Wait, no, that's mine. Wait, darn it, hold up, hold up. I hate it when I right click and it like unorganizes my items. Okay, this is a vanity item, but it's an accessory, so, ooh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, all right, well, I guess I'll go with this for now. Oh, your eyes are a spell. What is this? Oh, nice, it is it is wings, I think. Wait, no, maybe it isn't. Hold on, let me, let me see, is this? Oh, nice. <laughs> it's just like floaty boot wings or something. That's pretty cool. Uh, it definitely looks cool. I think I'm just going to stick with the B wings for now, though. Uh, shiny stone greatly increases life regen when not moving. Spiked eye of the golem. That's pretty good. Uh, I should probably fight him again. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do that since I have so many of these things. All right, let's buff for more magic power. Set up some of this and go.
All right, and it looks like that is it. Seven, <laughs> seven of the things down, right? Uh, yes, I do not have any more because I actually did fight eight because, oh, and I got a goodie bag from him. Oh, goodie, that's awesome. Oh, a treasure bag and a goodie bag. What a joyous day. All right, well, that was pretty good. Um, I really need to get that, that darn pickaxe though or pick saw or whatever the heck it is, but I'm gonna get the heck out of here for right now and open up all these bags. Oh man, that's so cool getting a, a developer set. That is awesome. Oh, and look at that, all my death weeds ready. You know what? I actually have so much death weed. <laughs> I don't even need any more, but I might as well get a little bit more because you can never have enough of it. This does take a while to grow, so yeah. Better have too much than too little, especially because I did use up a lot of magic power potions. Uh, so that's a bit unfortunate. I mean, definitely worth it. We're gonna see just how worth it. So, yeah, I got like, oh, a hop and jack. I did get his banner, by the way. I don't remember if that was on camera or not, but whatever. Um, all right, so let me go ahead and put this pumpkin stuff away. I feel like I'm going to need a new chest for this. Um... Hmm, I don't know where I can put it, though. <laughs> That's the problem. I need to expand this, like, a lot. Uh, let's just, for right now, go ahead and take this water chest. We're going to take this thing, and we're going to put it right over here! Yeah, there we go. Okay, so let me go ahead and drop off some of the stuff that I already got. Um, I'll just kind of put related things there. Goodie bag. Aw, rotten eggs. That's rotten! Oh, man. Okay, well, it's fine. Let's go ahead, drop off this money. Grab these goodie bags, too. I forgot about those. And my Plantera bag. Did I... Yeah, I, I did open that, right? I'm pretty sure I did. I don't think I would have waited on that. Would I have? Yeah, that's right. I got the Venus Magnum gun and the Pygmy staff, which is cool. Okay, that's great. And let's see. Oh, Hallow's Eve. Cool painting. Oh my goodness, this looks really cool. What? Oh, that's awesome. Um, this needs to be put up somewhere. I gotta show it off. I don't know where. Uh, how about right here? Oh, that's really cool. It's like rainbow hair or something. Um, another reaper set and a fox set. Oh yeah, I'm a fox. Look at me guys, I'm Firefox. Uh, no, I think I'll stick with your razors. <laughs> but yeah, that's cool because I did not have the fox set yet. Uh, all right. Oh, I kind of want to get like a space suit and be Fox McCloud. Um, anyway, let's, guess I'll drop off the reaper stuff here. I have three sets now, darn it. Okay, let's open up all these treasure bags. My goodness, what on earth will I get? Uh, ooh, Possessed Hatchet, although I think I have that banned until after Fish Run, if I'm not mistaken. Um, ooh, Heat Ray, magic, nice. Uh, and also like 82 gold, that's a lot. Stinger, cool. Never played around with that. Oh, the Staff of Earth, that, could be interesting, but probably not. Oh, yay, Sunstone! That's wonderful news. Um, and... Celestial Staff of Earth. Yeah, okay, well, I got a lot of these shiny stones, that's for sure. But they're the expert mode item. And yeah, as you might have seen in the video sped up, well, <laughs> I equipped the Eye of the Golem by mistake first. I thought that's what it was, but no, this, uh... Increases your life regen by a lot when you're not moving, which is pretty cool. So let's see. This is 89 magic damage. This is 87. This shoots a piercing ray of heat. How much mana does he use? Six compared to five. See, I just don't know why I'd want to use that over the other. Maybe I'm just not... I don't know. I mean, this is fast. But so is this. And this, like, bounces off of stuff. I don't know, um, but maybe I'll play around with it. And then the other thing is this Staff of Earth, which uh, makes a boulder. <laughs> hey, you guys, wanna go golfing? Whoa! <laughs> All right, uh, yeah, probably not the best thing, but I don't know, it could be kind of useful. I actually don't know what I'd use it against. Um, I'll find a situation for it for sure, 
And then, of course, the possessed hatchet's wonderful. It, like, locks on to enemies. And then the stinger. Now, I've heard good things about this. Um, I've never used it, though. Or at least not, like, in any serious capacity. So, I don't know. I also got two platinum from all that, which is a lot. I'm up to 24. I feel pretty good about that. I can also make so many solar fragments or solar eclipses right now. It's pretty crazy. Plus, on top of that, I can sell all this stuff and get a lot of money. Each of these gives me, like, a lot of gold, and I don't need any more than one. So, let me get rid of some of these. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll get rid of all but this one, because I would want to reforge it anyway. And then the possessed hatchet. Again, I don't need two of those. I don't need two staves of earth. Just free money, really. Uh, and beetle husks, I can get a ton of money for these. In fact, I can't even use beetle armor. I don't think until after the Moon Lord, so maybe I should just get rid of it. It can only be used in beetle armor, if I'm not mistaken. Let me double check. Uh, let me put my boots back on. Okay, beetle husk. What is this? Beetle wings. Oh, I guess I could make these. But yeah, I can't make this stuff. In fact, let's see. Eight, six, eight, eight, and four. Uh, I mean, I'm not even mathing right now. I can tell you right now that 46 will be enough. <laughs> More than enough. So let's just go ahead and sell some of this. Um, all right. Yeah, we'll sell off this stack. I can always fight the golem again. But I'd rather have that gold, thank you very much. Okay, so let's go ahead and make the celestial shell, which is so good. It just requires the sunstone and the moonstone. Actually, it does require a lot of different things. I wonder if I have enough moonstones. I I don't know. I've gotten so many of them. Um, they're moon charms? No, I want moonstones. That's right. I mean, it does take both. Let's go ahead and take the Moonstone and the Sunstone, and that should give us, or give me, the Celestial Stone. Very good. And I can combine that with the Moon Shell to make the Celestial Shell. It's so hard. It's so hard to make, that's for sure. Yeah, it's very end game. I don't remember if I have it banned or not. I don't think so, because it's just really good. It's good to have, but it does take up an accessory slot but I definitely want to get something very good on this. Uh, no, not precise. Not fleeting. It's so expensive to reforge. Actually, Lucky is pretty good. That extra critical hit chance does add up. Um, hmm. That is very tempting. So I think I can get rid of this. Like, if I had to prioritize, putting uh, this instead of that would definitely be better. Uh, at least I think so. Like, the added life regen is just so good. Okay, so that adds plus four crit chance. So, let's take this. 33. Yeah, that's pretty pretty nice, actually. Okay, well, that's great. That is some very good news. Um, let me... I don't know. I don't know. I've probably done enough for today. I mean, I beat Plantera, and I beat the, uh... The Golem a few times. I'm going to go back to the temple and I'm gonna work on a farm for the ocean at some point because that that'll be necessary it'll be good to have a nice jungle farm there's a few different ways to go about it but I think the way I want to do is actually one involving conveyor belts I'm gonna play around with oh no not you not you we want where's the steampunker at oh there she is we want you yeah conveyor belts they're pretty cool um where are they right here so, yeah, I'll probably get some of these and incorporate them. Now, they don't move mobs, but they do move drop loot. And that could be handy. I really don't know. It's not super necessary, but it might help. I don't know. We'll have to see. Anyway, I'm going to leave things off here for today. Definitely feel like we got a lot done. Um, Yeah, I mean, as far as, like, bosses and stuff go, we really only have the, uh, you know, the celestial events over here now. Well... I'll have to fight the lunatic cultist. And then Duke Fishron. Actually, I don't know if I'll fight Fishron first or second or what. Because he's pretty tough and expert. But I also do feel pretty good about Duke Fishron, too. I mean, he can be tough, but if you're good at, like, dodging 
then he, he's not quite as bad. But still bad. But yeah, anyway. We'll figure out what to do, but I think there's going to be building episodes now that I can get the traps and things. Although I didn't get the pick saw, that's right! Oh, man! Alright, well, I'm going to have to fight him again. But I can also just farm goodie bags over that spot. I gotta get that egg anyway. There's an egg that the lizards drop. And I need to get it. It's pretty rare, but they do spawn really fast there. So, I don't know. I'll figure something out. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you on the next episode of Maryland's Terraria Expert Mode Adventure. Whoa! <laughs> see you next time, boulders.